Hi, this is Kevin with KGM Jam Owner Pro Advertisers Club, a totally free site to advertise. Go to ProAdvertisersClub.com, join for free today, and start advertising for free. Okay, this is a Silver Age comic. They're only dropping 5,000 of them, so that's what they've been doing lately. They've adapted to the market, but uh, what that means to me, as uh, what I see in the future is, the, especially being a Silver Age comic, because Vivi's only dropped one Golden Age comic, and that's Marvel's number one back in the 1930s, I think it was. And other than that, it's all been Silver Age. So uh, if you're you know, into NFTs or thinking about getting into them, uh, Silver Age, you know, Golden Age, even if you don't know much about comics, that's what you want to accumulate. And then the second thing you want to look for is mint number, the the, the amount. And 5,000 just isn't, it, it is now, it's a lot, but it won't be one day. And when that, and when that happens, like I think this is uh, Avengers number six. How much time we got left? And um, so when, you know, people, when it becomes mainstream, which it one day will, the people coming looking for some issues, some of these issues will be real low mint. And then, you know, the, the new, the, the ones that they drop later will have more mint, you know, as they get more people in, the mint numbers will go up to 10,000 and 50,000 and 100,000. And these type drops will be very sought after, in my opinion, not entertainment or uh, not uh, financial advice, entertainment purposes only. Listen to meet your own risk. Financial, uh, I am not a financial advisor in any uh, way, shape, or form. But uh, you know what I'm trying to say here. And, and so this is something I'll get, it, it, right? Like you could have maybe flip the secret rare, but this is going to be a get and sit on and just see what happens with it. And then the, another strategy I got is I try to max out the common cover at 10 issues each. And, uh, okay, this is, let's buy it. I'm not sure if this one's going to sell out because of the $10. It's usually $6.99. Okay, I got one. Yeah, I'm not positive this one's going to sell out. Because, like I said, it's usually $6.99. A $10 price tag will chase a lot of people away, but you never know. So we'll see here. Let's make sure it took my... Yeah, it took my gems. So let's go back here. and It should pop in here in a second. What we're going to try to find out is what rarity I got. I own one edition, so here we go. I got the uncommon. So, is that better than the regular cover? I don't believe so. I really like the 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 way that VV's got it set up. Is the common cover is the original cover? Then the on uncommon is usually the original cover minus some colors which I don't understand that. Why not just go out another whole new cover? Um, rare is then uh, rare, ultra rare. Those are usually VV exclusive covers, but again, kind of lazy because why not get two different? This is right here. These three issues, you could have gotten three different artists, have three different covers and give them some work. But this is kind of lazy to me just taking color out and then calling it a, an addition. And then the secret rare is pretty cool. They, they remove the background and then put a uh, image of something that looks like the, the drawing. It might even be the original artist. They, if he's still alive type thing, they do sometimes. Uh, so that's the way they're doing it. Now, candy does it different. They do uh, the core, which is the common. And then they got the uncommon, the rare, the epic and then legendary is how they call it. But all five covers are the same and the way they're doing it then, but the covers are in different 
uh, stages of decay. So like the, uh, I think the uncommon in candy is the worst. And then of course the legendary is 10.0 as far as a rating goes. So that's pretty neat too. But in Vivi, I really do like to collect 10 of the common covers. Cause I think in the long run, these will be more valuable like because they're just so rare, the, you know, the secret rares. But the covers is what the average collector is going to want, is the original comic. Now, they're all the same comic inside because you can read these. These are NFTs, and you can open them up, read them. You can put them in AR and imagine there's going to be other things. Eventually, we're going to be able to burn them, craft them, do all sorts of stuff. Uh, but... Um, so, yeah, well, why I get 10 is one's for me and nine's to flip it, on, on the Silver Age comics. And then on any other kind of comic, I just get it if it's an important issue. And right now, BB's in its fifth year, fourth year, three, four, three plus years, and... Pretty much everything they drop has some kind of significant first appearance, first issue, something important in the history of the comics. So you really can't go wrong unless you, of course, sell it at a loss, which I don't know why people would. Uh, I call it set and forget and just see what happens. So anyway, um, please like and subscribe. You get a chance. Go check out Pro Advertisers Club. Um, I know your time's important. Thank you for spending it with me and have a nice day.